For some of the cheapest FIFA coins on the market right now, be sure to check out FIFAUltimateTeamCoins.com and use the discount code HOB for the most money off your coins. Enjoy. Hey guys, and welcome back today to another episode of Be A Legend. Now, I do apologise, I know that a lot of you really like this series, and it's been a few days since I've actually uploaded one, and it's basically because I was trying to think of something, collating all your comments together from the last video about how I can make this a little bit more Christmassy. So the way it's going to work is today I'm going to try and build a starting 11 which spells the word Christmas. Got to try and do it logically in some sort of way. So the goalkeeper has to start with a C, the left back has to start with a H, the centre back with an R and you know all of that sort of stuff. I can spell Christmas, I just don't want to spill it all out and bore you guys to death. So let's start off by seeing what we can do in a 4-1-2-1-2 formation with Christmas. So let's look for a Goalkeeper, okay, we've got a rare goalie beginning with C. We've got Casilla, which I guess is the start. Let's see if we've got a H for a left back. We've got a... La 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 la. Okay, we've got one, but he's the worst left back we've got. But we're going to go with it anyway, because it is Christmas after all. We're now looking for an R. Come on, surely we've got to have a centre-back beginning with R. Surely, we got Rolando. All right, that works. C-H-R-I is the next one we're going for. For some reason, I don't think we're going to have one beginning with I because it's um it's one of those sort of annoying, stupid letters, isn't it, really? There's got to be someone beginning with I around here. Okay, we don't have any players beginning with I, so we're going to open some packs in a moment, as we do at the start of every Be A Legend episode, and hope we get someone that starts with I. So C-H-R-I-S. We're looking for a right back beginning with S. Let's see. We, we don't have one of those either. This <laughs> this isn't going very well. I should have planned this a little bit better. So, T. We've got a CDM, hopefully, beginning with the letter T. If we don't, we're going to have a bit of an issue. Tetty. Okay, we've got a CDM beginning with T. So, even though we miss out the I and the S, which we've got to hopefully get in a pack, we've got someone beginning with T. Now, the left-hand side of midfield, we've got to have someone beginning with M. Oh, that's so, that's such a troll. Nazri, that's close enough to M, but we we can't use him. And then let's go Cam. We've got to have someone beginning with A. Oh, no. They're not being very nice at all, are they? Atsu. All right, that's not too shabby. And then the last letter is S, which we will definitely take Shakiri for that position. So the two strikers, I can choose who they are because we've got a BPL Cam in Atsu, let's go with a BPL set of strikers, and we are going to have Jovatic and Falcao, which a lot of you have been suggesting in the comments section. Hmm, we're going to do it so that we have to have a player in centre-back, right-back, and left midfield, which goes by the name of Santa Claus and his reindeer. Right, so let me quickly do a little Google search for the name of Santa Claus reindeer. List of reindeer. That a good start. Okay, so it's taken me about two and a half minutes to Google search the name of Santa's reindeers. It's Christmas. You'd, you'd have thought you'd be able to find it a little bit easier at this time of year, but we have got Dasher, Dancer, Prancer, Vixen, Comet, Cupid, Donna, and Blitzen. So we're going to try and find a centre back beginning with D. But you get Dante. There we go. That's a decent start. We've got Dancer. So let's see if we've got a right back beginning with D. Debushi. This is going very nicely now. And then who's the next one? Prancer. Left midfielder beginning with P. It's not looking very good at the moment. Nope. Uh, next one, Vixen beginning with V. Definitely no Vs in this team. Comet beginning with C. We got Chadley. Okay, so that is the look of the team that we've got. This is a Christmas forward slash reindeer related team. Let's open some packs. The new team of the week is out and I thought it was going to be a bit better than this. But unfortunately it isn't. So... Here we go, 10 packs at the beginning of this episode. Let's get into it. Pack number one. Come on, give us an inform. We don't get anyone. That's uh, that's a bit of a letdown, to be honest. We get Mares, who the right midfield position. No, nope, that's not that's not the one we need. I'm going to be trying to make some squads as well, guys, from sort of different leagues instead of just using this BPL team. So hopefully we can get, uh, you know, we're looking for a good variety of players throughout. So... That's a pretty boring pack, but we're going to send it all to the club. Please give me a good player. Okay, we get Aiden McGeady and we get Backer, which I guess in the long run is two pretty decent players for whatever squad I choose to make. Pack number nine, Tim Howard. Skip it. Oh my God, we get the bad Suarez. We get Naismith. 
Okay, so the last pack of the day coming up now. I don't think we've actually packed anyone who could warrant to fit into this Santa Claus Christmas related team. Casillas! Yes, that's actually a very, very good pack. Casillas and Eto. I will take that all day of the week because Christmas begins with C. Casillas begins with C. He's going to fit perfectly into the squad. That is actually a really, really sick pull. If I actually press the right button, we can swap him for Casillas. Very, very good indeed. Okay then, guys. So what is on your screen right now is the team that we are going to use in the first match of this first Christmas episode of Be A Legend. Now, we didn't manage to spell Christmas entirely, but what we've got here on the screen is a mixture of the spelling of Christmas. We've got Casillas. We've got this guy on the left, Heymans, which is the H. We've got Rolando, which is the R. We've got Dante, who is the one of the one of the reindeers, and so on and so forth. You guys get the idea. Let's get into match number one. All right, here we go. Let's see what this Christmas team is playing against. The name is Tornadoes, and it's not the best team in the world, but it does have 100 chemistry, which is really going to screw me over because I've got like 60 chemistry. All right. Let's go. See what we can get out of these players. Basically, you could say that these Christmas players are auditioning for a place in the main team. Because I'm feeling like changing up the main team to just, you know, make things a bit different. Oh no. Don't concede a goal already. Come on, it's Christmas. Be nice. So he goes and puts in a sweaty ball. I don't understand. Mate, you're a dickhead. You're an absolute... You're a, you're a knobhead. You're a nasty person. Now, I haven't played this game in a while... But since it's updated, it, it just feels so shit. Like, why would you put a game back to an older game? Like, it feels like FIFA 14. Why would they change a game that was actually very good and make it play like an old game? Don't quite understand that. Let's go at Sue. Let's go at Sue. Oh, look at that. It lags just as I'm about to shoot. This game is so bad sometimes. Like, it, the connection's been perfect. As soon as I'm one-on-one, -on -one, it just lags so much. Go on, Jovetic. Oh, my God. Come on. Blow the whistle, ref. Yes, Casillas. That is a Christmas number one, that save right there. That, that was a brilliant save. Okay, so at halftime, I'm 1-0 down. And, as always, dominating possession. But I just don't... I can't get used to this change in this game. It's like I'm going back a couple of years and playing an old FIFA. It's just shit. But let's see if we can do something better in the second half. Because this has got to improve. All right, now that was actually a shot from Debushi. I I'll own up and say that that was probably the worst attempt on goal I've ever had. Ever. Come on. We're playing well. We're playing better. Let's go, Chadley. Let's go, Jovetic. Oh, lovely, neat footwork. Sprint. Oh, no, wait. You can't sprint properly on this game anymore because it's so freaking slow. And the, the lag. I don't know if you guys can see this on the gameplay recording. But the lag every time I get near the goal is so bad. Why? 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 I don't believe this is so shit. I don't get it. 2 0 down. Two of the stupidest goals you could ever concede. A sweaty goal in the first half. Now that one. Go on, Atsu. Go. Go. Have a shot. Oh no. Oh no. 3 0. I'm literally. I don't know what to say. I do not know what to say. I'm going to have to get rid of the two highest rated players on this team. And to be honest, Casillas has done absolutely nothing. So I've got a funny feeling Casillas' stay in this club is going to be one match long. He's going to have to be sold. This is a joke and a half. I've run out of ideas to what I can do against this kid. Like, every time I get near the goal, it just lags like I don't know what. The only player who's actually been any good for me has been this guy, Atsu. Like, he's the only good player. I might even have to sell Falcao or Jovetic. But I've just got a feeling it's going to be Casillas. Oh, no. Okay, so we lose the first game of this episode, 3-0. But, you know, obviously I don't want to make excuses. But this game genuinely feels so much different. It's, it seems slow. It seems sluggish. It just doesn't seem to be as good as it was. Like, I don't know. Let me know in the comments down below if you play FIFA regularly and you think since the last update the game has just got just really bad. Let me know down below. Let's see who the two lowest rated players are in this team. Okay, it's not Casillas and it's not Falcao. No, not Debushi. Okay, I've got to sell Debushi and Chadley. Now, Chadley not so bad because he's the first time he's played and he did absolutely nothing. But Debushi, 
Well, Chadley can be quick sold because, well, I don't think anyone should ever buy him. And we will list Debushi on the market. It's a very sad moment, guys, to be honest. I'm very disappointed in that. I am going to go back to this squad right here, which is my number one team. And what I want you guys to do in the comments down below, I want you to let me know what you think, to, what team you'd like me to make next. Now, you can see what sort of players I've got here. Maybe you want me to make a full nationality team. Maybe you want me to make, I don't know, whatever you want me to try. I will be more than happy to give it a go. So, let's see again. We'll get BPL left back. Where is it? Where's Aspilic... Okay, Aspilicueta's on the bench. Thank God for that. There we go. Aspilicueta there at left back. And goalkeeper, we want our Premier League keeper back. And that is going to be... Where's he gone? What? We don't have a Premier League goalie. Okay, we're going to try Michel Vorm to make his debut in goal. That is what we are going to go for. As you can see here, we are back with our Premier League team. And, you know, I'm, I'm still very angry about that last match. But we are going to go into the next match right now. All right, so he's got a Serie A team. He's got Inform Hamsic, he's got Bia Biani, he's got El Sharawi, Higuain, De Rossi, Evra, Caceres, Barzagli. I think that's Conco at right back. <sighs> Michel Vorm on his debut, turning up at this moment in time. Looks like a very good goalkeeper, actually. Go on, Sacco. You're going to have Bia Biani for pace. Of course you are. Not. That is so unlucky again! Three defenders, and they managed to get the ball to his striker. I'm... Oh, this is so frustrating. Literally, I can't... I don't know what I'm doing wrong at the moment. Like, look at this. We've got five players within an area of, like, a metre. Yet the ball still manages to fall to his attacker. I'm done. I'm actually done. I, I don't understand. What is going on? This game is so broken. I can't do anything. I cannot do a single thing. Come on, Oscar. We need a comeback like we almost got in the last episode. There we go. Falco. How? Why? Why? Oh, my God. I don't know what to do anymore. I'm one-on-one. -on -one. I don't want the free kick. I'm sorry, but I just don't. Come on, Fernandinho. Oh, my God. I'm done. I literally don't know what to say at this moment in time. Yes, Matic! Come on! Serves him right for trying to do bloody rainbow flicks with El Sharawi in his own box. There's a goal for Matic. I believe that might be his actual first goal for the club. We are back in the game. Two and a half minutes or three minutes in to the second half. Nemanja Matic with the goal. Look at you guys. There you all are. Celebrating with me in the corner. Nice little goal that actually. Takes it back a little bit. Plants it between two defenders and the goalie. Yes, here we go. Here we go. Thomas Ince. Drill it low. Go on. Get on the... Oh! Yes, Fernandinho. Fernandinho. Left foot. Off the... What? Off the inside of the crossbar. And it... Oh, my God. The shittest goal in the world. Fernandinho this time. Falcao. Wahey. 3-2. Back in the game. Two minutes to go. We need another goal. I don't believe it. For the second time this episode, we have lost the match. Now we've got to see who the two lowest rated players were in this squad, in this current team. Okay, we have to sell Yanmar and Koscielny. Koscielny is probably our best centre-back as well. So we're literally just getting rid of right-backs. And now we've got to get rid of Koscielny as well. This absolutely sucks. Why this game has changed so much in the period of a week. And one freaking update so yeah we have got to quick sell we're going to quick sell Yanmark because he's not going to sell for anything and we've also got to list Koscielny who has become a very very pivotal part of this team all right then guys so that is probably the first time in a long time that we've lost two matches in one episode of be a legend now I want to keep this series going as frequently as possible so if you guys can drop a like rating on the video that will let me know that you're excited to see the next episode of Be A Legend. So thank you very much for watching. I hope you're all having a great day and enjoying the festive period. Let me know as well in the comments down below if you are now off school for Christmas. Let me know and I'll see you all next time. Goodbye. So they're asking me questions about like road signs for trams, which trams like are basically a train that goes through the street. 
I've never seen a tram in England, ever. You know, obviously I've still practiced those questions about trams. What shape is a, is a, is a speed sign for a tram? Like, 